Defending champion Dylan Minetti started the third round of the prestigious Northeast Amateur at Wanamoisa Country Club with a commanding six-shot lead after a tournament record score of 12 under par halfway through. Minetti two-putted the first four holes for pars before making a short birdie putt on five. After a bogey on six, nearly a birdie on the seventh. The lead was nine as most of the field struggled not to drop shots. Playing partner Kelly Chin just misses the bird on three. Caleb Surratt, two nice par saves on four, and then on seven. Six under overall after three rounds, but not good enough with the roll Minetti was on. Top five ranked amateur in the world and NCAA singles champ Gordon Sargent out of Vanderbilt made a couple of moves, but a bogey on seven, so the lead was up to eight. Sargent also finished, tied for second at six under. Manetti birdied nine, and here the short tap in bird on 10. His lead was nine on the back nine. Nine and 10 was great to have like two footers. So, I mean, it was really nice to have an easy way to get in there. Same with uh, 13 as well. So my wedges were a lot more dialed today than normal. So I was, that was good for me to get going. Soon, he was 16 under despite a bogey on 15 but he made up for it with a bird on 16, even though the cameraman and Dylan both gave up on it before it made it to the hole. The back nine was great. I mean, it was unbelievable, the back nine. 16 putt was unbelievable, it was like trippy. It was like, ooh, I didn't think that was gonna go in. But besides that, there's a couple other ones out there a little squirrely, I made two bogeys today, so it was like, oof. Another bird on 17 to get to a record 17 under par, nearly 18 under on 18. Yeah, I mean, I always want to get better. I was really hoping to make that putt, and my putter's super hot today, so I just want to keep it going, get a big, big, big enough lead for tomorrow. So hopefully I can just keep it going tomorrow and do the same thing I was doing today. You did tell me yesterday that if you had a 10-shot lead, you could relax on the final round. <laughs> Will you relax on the final round? Probably a little bit. I mean, I still want to shoot a really good score again. I, I don't think I've ever shot four pars or four times under a par, so I think last year I shot even or one under one of the rounds, so hopefully I can just like keep going and break that streak for me. Defending champ Dylan Minetti will have an 11-shot lead heading to the final round. There will be a great race, but for second place. Make sure you check out all the scores and pairings by visiting northeastamateur.com. I'm Don Coyne reporting.